everyone, welcome to today's video. Hope you enjoyed those pictures at the beginning. Now, if this is something that you're interested in trying to do yourself with, you know, some piece of tech that you might have, and this is actually, for me, this was the GoPro. This was the GoPro 7 black, as you can see here on the side. Um, and it's not something that I ever thought to do, but um, I heard last night that it was gonna be Elon Musk's um, Starlink satellites in the sky, and I thought, I wonder if I can capture any of them. And I found that on this GoPro, if you actually, normally it's on this when I first open it up, if you swipe to the right and you go to photo, what you can do is you can click the little icon in the bottom left, and normally set to photo, you've got burst and night. And if you just click on the night feature, and then you can do a stopwatch, um, like a little timer countdown. Now, three seconds, 10 seconds is fine, because you want it to be as still as possible. So when you click the sort of record, take photo button, then it's not shaking. So at least three seconds, maybe 10. Um, and then at the bottom, you can change the shutter, which I've got on the highest that the GoPro does. It does something like five, 10, 15, 20, 30 seconds, set it to 30. Um, I've got it set to wild field of view just because I wanted to capture as many styles as possible, but you can have lineal if you want. And at the bottom left, you've got the, I've got the um, sort of pro feature turned off, but I'll just quickly show you that if you do have it on, it's pretty cool, like for someone who's more into their photography, you can actually change like the sharpness, the ISO, um, you can change the white balance, but in all honesty, for me and for an amateur this, and if you just want a very quick picture, 30 seconds, and boom, you are done, set to go. All you do is press record, have it pointing up at the sky, and uh, you'll get the sort of pictures that I did last night. Now I did give them a little boost of color and a little edit when I was actually in Photoshop, but as standard, the pictures were very, very good. But um, yeah, why don't you try out, see if you can get any pictures, if you've got a clear sky above your house. This is in the UK, which I just thought I'd point out, but I'm sure this would work all around the world. But at the moment we are having some very nice clear skies here in the UK. So I thought take the opportunity to try out a little bit of amateur star photography. If you like this very short snappy video on hopefully a feature that um, you'll be able to try out, please give me a thumbs up, really appreciate that. And maybe subscribe to the channel if you are new and hit the little bell icon to keep up to date with future videos. Thanks everyone for watching. See you again soon. Bye.